He's got the Tweety Birds floating around him like back in the old days. He can be singing stars and some chops, because I'll tell you, he, he took the words of that beat. Yeah, he took a brunt to that. Chico looks like he's hurting a little bit, too. He could be, sing he could be singing Twinkle, Twinkle Little Star tonight, I'll tell you, Frankie. Well, fans, our next match is scheduled to be a ladies' match. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this next contest is a girls' match. I believe it needs ladies. The referee for this contest is Rob Tuttle. A ladies' match, making a return engagement here in Everett. It's been a while since we've had a, uh, a ladies' match. Introducing yeah, the first. first. From New Bedford, Mass, at five foot six inches tall, Amber. Five foot six. That's a nice. Or else. She's been known to break the rules. Watch out for behind. See what I mean? Hair pull means nothing to this young lady. I'm on the boat so early. You can't play to the crowd sometime. It'll backfire on you. Yeah, it usually does. You need to be paying attention at all times to the square circle. Well, fans, we're trying to get you an update on Len Oddities. You heard the uh, mastermind say he was taken to the hospital to get some stitches and as those couple of chair shots in his match. Hip toss. Of course, and our, our referee Joey Keith, he was splashed by Mike DiPietro and has not been seen since. Oh, are you kidding me? They, so, you'll see him tomorrow morning at the Pancake House. Nice body slam. So we'll see if we get a, a, an update on our referee Joey Keith. Almost a three count. Of course, the, the dog collar match. We got bodies hitting all over the place here. Tonight. Oh, right to the eyes. Yeah, the dog collar match was fantastic. That gave the fans definitely. That was worth the price of admission alone. I mean, what else could go on here tonight, fans? I'll tell you. Oh, it's early yet. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Good suplex. Cover. Oh, what? Pull the hair up. What's the punisher some more? Amber making a statement here at RSC. And that could cost you. You never give your opponent a break, Frankie. You, you know that. Yeah, that's true. Slamming her head into the post. Deanna Deville looks like she could be winded. Oh, look at this one. That's one of my maneuvers when I was choke. in the ring. The foot stretch choke. I don't think you get your foot up that high anymore. I can still do it. Don't make me prove it. Oh, raking her eyes against the rope here. Yeah. Frank, I have to say so far, what I've seen, a, it's a new year, like you said, and RSC seems to have a new, a new edge of attitude. It does, and I, it's a good thing. We're bringing it up a level. People, wrestlers are coming in. You're seeing a lot of new people. This is where the action is. Look at this one over. Sunset flat. Beautifully oh, done. Beautifully cool. done by Deanna DeVell. Oh, yeah. She has her basics down. But i got to tell you something. Amber kicked out of that one, though. This Amber? It's a tough cookie. Oh! 
Oh, slamming her head straight down to that mat. It's that a could, four-foot drop. That could be it. One, two. Boy, I tell you, that was, that, that was, that was real close. close. That was two and a half. Real close. Snap yeah, takeover. Boy, I tell you, that was that that was, that was real close. close. That was two and a half. Real close. Snap yeah, yeah. takeover. Oh, oh kicks her right in the, the That's it. She's cinching it up, sapping the air out of him. It's a good basic, good basic move. She's telling the ref what to do here. I tell you, I like this girl's attitude. Well, I figured you'd say that. Well, you know, you know me. I, I, I have to admit it. I was a rule breaker, but I've seen the light. Somewhat. Deanna Deville try to get the crowd. Well, then she has to get up. She has to get on her feet to, to relieve yeah, the breath. Yeah, she got that. Go to the black. She's trying to fight. Oh, it worked. A couple of blows to the making a comeback here, yeah, Deanna Deville. Showing some intestinal fortitude. Beautiful clothesline. What's some authority? <laughs> oh, nice. It's a leg, leg toe hold. Oh, look at this one. That's a nice wrestling on the bridge to boot. Dana DeVille showing some real skill here. That's a new, an unusual move. Now, that's man. something I can say I never did. Oh, yeah. Oh, she don't want to let go. It's a submission hold. I know what. The oh, that's a small. Oh, that, that's when you. It, it puts oh, pressure on your lower spine. Deanna Deville. And use and use a finishing hold, Frankie. Yeah. Well, from our vantage point, because we could not see. What I start to say, Frank, is that from our vantage point, we cannot see that uh, that the submission hold, but uh, apparently it was, and. Uh, and the end of the field come out with the victory. But what it does is it applies pressure on the small of the back. As you can see, when she finally got up, she was, she was holding her lower lumbars, the number eight and seven. Well, could you say number seven and eight instead of eight and seven? All right, ladies I always and go back. It is with, it is with to great pleasure that I introduce to you the... You know, I'm trying to start a new leaf with you. Don't push me. Of, the mastermind's coming out again. Entertainment. T.J. Anderson. Oh, how could that be his pleasure? T.J. Anderson is not loved here in Everett. Well, some of the fans love T.J. See, he's always taking my water. Well, you never give the man the respect he deserves as the co-owner of the company. You know, at least I'm, I'm going to put spit in his one of Let me tell you. See, he's as arrogant as the The greatest wrestling mind of all time. Just so you know. All right, maybe a new year. I got Save old TJ. This for all of you tonight. Now, I know you don't read a lot, but just so you know, there's a final in from Indianapolis. Colts 38, Patriots 34. How about them Colts? Woo! You know, the last time he was on that show, he seemed a little intoxicated. Hey, I made money. What is he doing now? That's all that I have to do here. This man's losing his mind, isn't it? I got a couple of guys right now. They're going to challenge for the tag team title tonight. So without further ado, let me introduce... You don't deserve to see these guys, but I'm going to bring them out anyway, because you deserve a treat in this godforsaken city. Ladies and gentlemen, Sabotage! T.J. Anderson, introducing Team Sabotage. That's Die Hard Eddie Edwards at D.C. Dillinger. Will the co-owner make it, make an offer? The sabotage. You never know, anything can happen there. Fans don't like.
Michael. Fans letting them have it. See guys, I told you these fans don't deserve greatness like this in the ring. That's not mine, let me tell you that. Well, let's see what the commissioner has to say. I'm sure it's going to be good. Well, I'm going to tell you, in the past I've stuck up for my many occasions, but this is a new year and I don't like when he talks bad about my city. As you know, I've always been devoted ever for it. I can't go out. We agree on something again. I'm trying, Paul. Time being your friend. So I think hard work ought to be resorted to the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame with a tag team title shot tonight against that idiot Ronald McDonald Goofy Quest. Bobby Stoffer working local security here at ringside. Stunning Sean Stevens. Uh, you guys have a pass. Very good athlete, never in his own right. But let me tell you something. He's a snake. He's a weasel. I know you have a history. I know he's your buddy. I know he's your buddy. But I'm going to tell you, he'll turn on you in a minute. He doesn't have the morals. He doesn't have the ethics as fine men like us. So what I want to know is... T.J. Anderson talking about that. Can you put this shot? Can you put businesses... Business is business. The commissioner being interrupted here. My shining short, Steve. There we go. Stunning Sean Stevens, interrupted. No, I'm, I'm telling you guys, he's, he's a snake, I'm telling you. Okay, the whole world knows, you're a, come over here in front of me when I talk to you. I own this company, I sign your paycheck, you stand right there when I'm addressing you. Wow, he's laying, he's going around. Right now with that title, I'll just hand it to him. So come stand you behind right here, okay? Don't be a loser like these people in Everett and New England Patriots. Don't be a loser, okay? Well, you look at the fans that hate you, T.J. Anderson just said a magic word. I want him on record right now, fans, to say it. I am disappointed in T.J. Anderson's attitude. I'll still take his checks, though. Yeah, that's fine, but I told these guys, business is business. You know, Quest wants to come out here, that's fine. Okay? He's probably hiding in the back somewhere, trying to find his goofy get-up and his stupid glasses and his... Dumbo. Oh! Speaking of Mr. Wednesday, 3 o'clock. Yeah, that's who you are. Sure you are. Sure you are. Let me tell you something. You got a tag team title match tonight. No, 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 no. You got gold on, don't you? Then you can then you can you can fight for the title. Now you, come here, you. I own this. Hey! If you people are in, don't shut up! We will leave! Let them have it. I'm telling you right now, we will walk out of this building and you won't have the privilege to watch me and Easy E. Don't make us do it. You people have no class. I don't wrestle a guy that wears a paw paw. I, I told you, you don't deserve greatness, so shut up and you'll get greatness. Now, you on the other hand, okay? Even if. Even if you somehow find your way to make it in tonight, okay, these guys, I think, are going to take the gold. Because you, my friend, you are irrelevant. Yeah. Well, watch out from behind. What's the kid lead play? Just in case. Oh, look at this. They beat up, they beat up Quest. Oh, Quest taking a beat in that right side of that all orchestrated by T.J. Anderson. Another sneak attack here. Every replay getting Mitch's shot. They're pounding on the champ here. Phoenix, take him out. Now the Phoenix oh, is going to the Phoenix on oh, the chair. Don't do it. Oh! Don't do it. Oh, I think they might have broke his back. He's definitely retired now. What a ch How do you like that? going to come save him. Oh. Night. Oh, they're laying the boots on him. This has got to show this here. company. I own this show. Oh, I own you. Oh, no, no, don't do oh. it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, devastating ball. How's that 
feel? Man, that hurts. We need some help out here. They cut the champion, Scott Osborne. We need some help. Oh, And Sonny going after Phoenix. Well, there we go. We've got action everywhere again, fans. We need, we need some help out here. Quest is seriously injured. Quest is down. Hey, can somebody come out here and scrape Quest off my floor? I paid for this gymnasium. Scrape his carcass out of Oh, TJ being What a typical. Oh, we've got all kinds of action here, man. Quest seriously injured. Now, Quest is seriously injured here. He took a couple of fishes. Uh, listen, champ, uh, champ, I wouldn't be too concerned with him. You have a match with the Phoenix, and because I own this company, that match starts right now. Give me a referee in here right now. What the heck is that? Referee, get in here. Hey, we got Mo. He's a professional. He wants to start. He wants to start the match yeah, now. Absolutely, it seems that way. The Phoenix is going to take on. Well, maybe if the ring the gets the right and boy. introduces my boy. In fact, you don't introduce the Phoenix. You don't deserve to. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the next ringside entertainment heavyweight champion, the Phoenix. Oh, Quest is hurt, eh? Yeah. Oh, here we go. You have a TJ Anderson just uh, putting Quest out of commission with his dog troopers. Henchman coming out of the wood like with TJ Anderson. Like Ladies and gentlemen, this is a non title tune up match between the Phoenix and oh, the look at this high fight action in the middle of the ring. Osborne. Well, he, TJ is, he's quite happy what he did. Quest is hurt. Oh, vicious up The tag titles are supposed to be defending later one. on, but I don't know, what about Quest? We well, I don't people. think Quest will be defending anything. Quest is on his way to a hospital right now. We got now, people probably. in the hospital, we oh. got people, I tell you, it's, oh. it's a car wreck out here tonight. I gotta tell you, you were saying, you were alluding to it earlier, like I told you, this is, uh, RSE is just taking it to another level in, in the year 2007. This match was supposed to be later on, fans, and uh, the commission decided to put it in right now. After after a wild melee with with, uh, with Quest being attacked by Team Elite, naturally. Yep. Well, some things never change, even with the New Year. Sapping the wind out of him there, leaning all his weight on him. Referee checking. Oh, driving the knee into the back. Fans out in front of us, I have the tag team belts with us. I have the heavyweight belt with us here. A lot of gold sitting on this table, fans. All right, I think the fans are stunned. I'm still stunned what happened to Quest. But it's been a night of surprises so far. I mean, uh, again, New Year, and, and, and a, definitely an edgy attitude as, as we... Uh, T.J. Anderson back at ringside. Extremely pleased with himself and his actions out here. Phoenix, you have to take off his ring attire. Uh, 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 Tuttle doing a little, little sleeper hole here. Sure. This, could, this could be it. Oh, no, no, no. well, Tuttle says he's alive. Uh, the fans uh, telling Phoenix that he, uh, well, I won't, you, you can pick it up, fans. I won't say what, what the fans are saying. The chair trying to come back with some elbows. Big, big clothesline. Another one, a hammering clothesline. Two the hell was that? Trying to call time. Time out. That's why this ref was suspended before. You, you, you should not be listening to anyone right now. He's the man of the ring. He's in charge. Why is the, cha the champ should go pin him? The champ should go pin him. Go ahead, Scotty, pin him. Go for the pin. What are you waiting for? What is Scott Osborne waiting for? I don't know. Pin him. Pin him. He's the champ. What is he waiting for? Pin him. I don't understand. I don't understand.
Smiling at the champion it makes no sense to me at all. <laughs> 